welcome back, folks, to more Let's Play Temtem in the last episode. We made it to Japanku finally, and now we need to try and find Belsoto's Flying Fortress and hopefully some digital Temtem. That would be lovely right about now. Could you just get me a digital Temtem? That would be, that'd be great. Also, I, oh no, I can go up here. That's fine then. A random Guz... Guzuma. Okay. Have you found him yet? Sir, not yet, sir. Our agent saw him leaving the city an hour ago. He must be hiding somewhere in this region. What are you doing here? Find him and bring him to me. Double time! Oh god, they're out in force now. That's not good. Alright. Oh no. <laughs> here come the Bel Soto. Hello. Mama found him. You blasted fool. This isn't him. This boy isn't even, even Katsuian. Huh? I mean, uh... And now we have to deal with him, or we'll run to the city and tell everyone we're here. Well, that's sort of the plan, but I'm gonna just murder you all instead. Drakash and a Banshee, alright. Do I have Grounder up front? I don't. Grounding, sorry. Grounder is from the Sonic cartoon in the... Jeez, uh... 90s? Alright. Well, Banshees are always a problem. They're always an issue, unless I've got an electric type out. Let's get some damage in. Bamboozle, all right, interest in play, interest in play. Heat up, oh boy, that's not good. All right, sod you then, Banshee. You can, you can take damage now. Uh, and I guess I'll go for, I guess I'll go for a Fierce Claw. No, no, Banshee's mental type. Oh, I don't really know what to do here with you. Okay, let's go for a Sand Splatter, sod it. Willpower Drain, sod you. Let me get your stamina. I want your stamina. Okay, there goes the evasion, that's fine. Sandstorm, that's gonna be annoying for Calps. Psy Surge, that's gonna be annoying for... Okay, Red Rookie, that's fine, I guess. You've lost a bit of health through overexertion, that's good for me. Uh, a Wind Burst on Dragash. On Dragash. Get some damage in, lovely. Fire... Oh, you're going for the Fire Tornado, all right. Oh boy. Red Rookie lives it, lovely. You've damaged yourself through everything. You're nearly dead. That nearly took you out there. Here's another meteor swarm. There goes Drakash. All right. Heat discharge. Well, it doesn't work on Kakaos. So sod you. Psypat. Interesting. Very interesting. To see the youth here. All right. Let's go for the. Uh, sorry. Let's go for the wind burst on Psypat. And the sand splatter on Banshee. That should be enough to finish Banshee off, I think. It is. Good. Good to see. Right, just got that bloody side pack to deal with. Luckily, we're dealing quite well with them already. Venomous Claws on to Red Rookie. That's fine. A Scaravolt. All right, then. That is very interesting. Oh, it's got a very good ability as well in half full. Oh, boy. That's not good. All right, burn it then. Nicho Sai. Uh-oh. Ow! Okay, that didn't do as much as I was expecting. Why Scaravolt already got half health? Oh, is that because of its ability half full? Okay, let's go for the Thunder Strike now. That is going to kill off Red Rookie. That's fine. I don't mind that. Yeah, I'm guessing that's ability. It goes to half health, but it gets like loads of stats. I don't. Okay, to be honest, that's not actually great. That's not actually a great move. To be brutally honest. It's not a great move. That. Alright then. Uh, mud shower and a sand splatter. Why not? Sand! Times four because you're uh, electric and fire, I believe, is your typing. Look what you've done, you incompetent fool. I'm, I'm sorry, ma'am. Cheers for the money. Alright. Wonder if there's anything new here. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? I want to do that before we get into the... Belsoto areas. Also, Legend Luffy, you have a Nimbus. Gee, all right. So first off, you're referencing One Piece, and you're whoa, Ampling. I what the hell are you? Yeah, that guy's referencing both Dragon Ball and bloody One Piece at this point. All right. Well, that's interesting. That's an Ampling. All right. Oh, it will survive. All right, that's good. Thunder Strike. All right, and that's a. Eh. Not a great shot on William, but you do have Thunderstrike. That's interesting. Alright. 
Burn's gonna do a bit more damage, that's fine. Ampling is no longer burned. Uh, I am gonna catch you with our attempt card plus plus. There we go. Use a attempt card plus plus for the first time. Hello, Ampling, welcome. Base electric type, it's got caffeinated. All right, so it can't, so it can't sleep. That's fine. Um, Ampling. Bamp B. Get it? Amp. Bamp B. And it's a deer. That'll do. That is your name. All right, nice. Very nice indeed. All right, well, we got a, we got ourselves an, uh, an Ampling. That's interesting. Hello. I got someone hiding in the tall grass. You, stop right there. Who are you and why are you prowling um, around this area? Uh, kicking Belsoto ass, mostly. We'll teach you a lesson before we hand you over to General Berhano. What did I say a minute ago? This is an undercover op. No names, you chump. <coughs> yeah, there's another one, is there? All right. Perinians and a Tortonite. All right, interesting. I have Kakaps and William. Perinians probably going to last, but Tortonite is not. It is level 66. It's quite powerful, actually. Crystal spikes on William. That's interesting. That's an interesting play. Burn! Take damage. Brilliant's gonna go for the humiliating slap. Okay, that is fine. Oh, Kakaps lives barely. All right, Water Blade. That didn't do too much. What type are you then? That's interesting. All right, I'm gonna try and get a Meteor Swarm off. And a Tsunami, why not? Might as well. Aquatic Whirlwind. Well, that's Kakaps dead. That sucks. That's bad. Because this isn't going to do too much damage. Not to Tor tonight, not to Brilliant. We'd prefer for you to attack William, but never mind. Toxic Gas. Okay. You've damaged yourself through overexertion. You fool! Alright, who do we want to bring in here? I guess Snarf. We'll bring Snarf in. Right, he is overexerted. I promise so am I. I'd rather him dead, to be fair. I would rather him die. Okay. Hunch! Okay, there goes Tor tonight. The evolved form of crystal there. Quite good, actually. Water jet. Ow, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. You have hurt yourself through every exertion, though. Which is good for me. William's up level 62. Good to see. All right. Punching time. And I guess I'll go for a noxious bomb. Why not? Get some damage in. Punch! Ah, damn, that did not do much. Okay, noxious bomb coming up now. More damage! Jeez, I am not doing much damage. You have to get some rest. Snarf is no longer cold, that's good. Probably should have gone for something else, really shouldn't I? Because now I'm in a bit of trouble. I am in a bit of trouble. Okay, I'm going to have to go for the noxious bomb here. Oh, aquatic whirlwind, and there goes Snarf. God damn it! Man, this Perinians is just taking me out right now. It does keep damaging itself through over exertion, though. The problem is William is also about to die. Jeez, this thing just won't let up. This bloody Perinians. All right, grounding and Terry. You're my last two. You should be able to finish him off. He's got to rest again, which is good for us. So we can get some, uh, we can get some damage in and finish you. Here's Claw. Jeez. So resistant, this Perinians. So resistant. I hope I'm faster than you. I'm not. Oh boy. That's a lot of damage to grounding. Cold immunity. Sod you, buddy. Fierce claw. You're dead. Damn, that thing was powerful. Alright. Grounding's up level 62. That's also good. If we make it back to Talobos, you will explain this to the general. Indeed. Oh, I need to think about healing my team. It's a good thing I do have my Tumescence file after all. One dose. We're good. Right, I've, I've, I haven't even checked the map here, have I? No, I haven't. Okay, that's where we need to go. Okay. Oh, battle. We have Temtem -tem battles, though. Okay, Scarawat and an Ampling. All right. Hmm. Very interesting. I am going to be running away from this, hopefully. Yes. All right. Really want to be sort of wasting my uh, power on, you know, other stuff, to be honest. On actual battles. Let's go down here. See what we can find. 
an opponent. Well, these walls are intense, buddy. So you're a climber. Guilty as charged. <laughs> yeah. Folks back home told me there was no point coming here to Chipanku. There are plenty of good climbing spots in the Kui uplands. But I'd like to try new places, you know. I need some fresh air after all that happened. It was overdue for a vacation anyway. Hey, I saw you climb down those things. Sweet gear, buddy. Thanks, they're a prototype. Yeah, no, they do look high-tech. I like the old traditional pilot thing, you know, but sure, I'd love to, but sure, I'd love to give those a go when they hit the shelves. Why don't we tempt him up? Hey, good idea. My arm should, could sure use a break. It'd be nice to work my brain instead of my limbs for a minute. Whenever you're ready, buddy. Thanks, I guess. You have a single roller. This is bad for Kakalps. It's level 62, so that's quite strong. Luckily, I'm going to burn it here to try and get at least a little bit of a uh, little bit of damage off. Windburst as well. Stone ball, that makes sense. Ow! That's a lot of damage to Kakalps there. You are getting burned. All right, sod you, willpower drain. Uh, and we'll keep going. We'll keep going with the uh, with the burning. I'm going to take all your stamina now. All your stamina is gone. You are getting burnt. What are you going to go for now? Another stone ball? All right, that's Kakalps dead. No! But also, Rolda will probably follow as well. Yep. You messed with Red Rookie. Red Rookie will drain your stamina. It's such a good move. I like it. I like it a lot. All right. Literally just there for him. Moving onwards. Where do we want to be going? We want to be going this way, I think. Do we? This way. Or is it this way? It's probably this way. It's not this way. There's actually nothing here. All right. Well, this way it is then. And we're off. Okay, climbing upwards. Oh, I'll take this while I'm here. Lovely, four 10 card pluses. Useful. All right. Uh, no, we do need to go back. Okay, that's fine then. We're gonna go on to this one here. Let's go. Running and stuff. Man, I'm surprised I haven't gone into a Temtem battle yet. <coughs> well, there they are. Sir, we found him. He was hiding behind a rock like a worm. He's injured and... Bring him in. He has much to tell us. What is that thing? It's huge. How can it float at all? And that man standing there. Is that General X again? I must hurry up. Find the Belsoto Flying Fortress. Well, it's right there. We know where it is. You bloody know where it is. We know where it is located. We can't jump there. We have to go here, I'm guessing. We have to go over here. Instead. Not there. We have to find some way through. Not there either. There, maybe. Don't send me on a wild goose chase game. I would not enjoy that at all. I enjoy this, though. Incubator tickets. This ticket contains all the information for the breeding center incubator to fast hatch a Temtem egg. All right, cool. Breeding's in this game. And a telomere hack defense. Alters chromosomes in Temtem DNA, adding one SV to defense and reducing the Temtem's fertility by one. Only works on non-lunar Temtem if the Temtem is soul-bound or you are the original tamer. Okay. Fair enough. We can't go that way. We can't go that way either. God damn it. And back we go. Back we go over here. God damn it. I said don't put me on a goose chase, mate. Don't do it. So I guess we need to go this way then. All right. Battle me. I'm annoyed. Another Temtem hater. I can't let you continue with your nefarious deeds. You're wrong, I love Temtem. Spare me. That's what all you dojo types say. But you love Temtem so much. They are pride and joy, yada yada. And then you turn around and kidnap them from their natural habitat. Imprison them in digital jails. And make them fight in pointless combats. Well, not on my watch. 
you do realize you have Temtem as well, right? You're literally doing the same thing that you're there having a go at me for. Moron. Ugh, all right, well. Now that we have a uh, little miss, um, I'm actually doing the exact same thing that I'm having a go at other people for. Miss Hypocrite over there. And there we go. That is fine. Oh god, you got Goulder. Well, it's not great for me, that. Alright, um, yeah, Gazuma, take some willpower damage. Take some, take some willpower. I want all that lovely willpower for myself. Thank you very much. Tsunami now activates. <coughs> Since it's William and Red Rookie, this should, yep, do some cold. Electric Storm, this is not good for either of William or Red Rookie. Yep, yeah. ow. A lot of damage, but Kazuma is dead. Good. Gulda with a harmful lick now. Ow! That's not good. Alright, let's go for a wind burst, I guess. And I guess I'll wait with William. Wind burst! Good damage there on Gulda. Another harmful lick. Is William gonna die here? The answer's yes. Okay, well, that's mostly fine. You've damaged yourself through overexertion, so uh, essentially anything I bring in here wins. Let's go with grounding. Yay, grounding. Grounding. Take that chamomile to your face. And this wind burst to your face as well. Victory against Gulda. Alright, nice. What a sad sight. Poor alienated Temtem fighting against their own liberators. Again, you have Temtem as well, you know. You bloody horrible, you're. <sighs> I suppose you're proud now. You think you've made a point or something? I have no time for this. Bugger off. Wait, I... Yeah, don't care. <laughs> if, you, if you think you've got like a quest for me or something, I really do not give a damn. Alright, well I want those two things up there. Those would be nice. Unfortunately, I don't have those right now. We will jump down. We finally got you, rebel scum. You regret the day you turned against Clan Bill Soto. You're just a bunch of thugs and murderers. Max was the only one of you worth their salt. That's why you had to kill them. Isn't that true, gentle coward? You like running your mouth? Good. Now you will tell me all I want to know about those deserter friends of yours. This time they won't get away. I must reach their fortress before they leave. Indeed! But battles first. Contact! We have contact! Oh, what now? Just as we get the word to get back to Telobos. Who in the down below are you? Scram, fool! Show me the way to Telobos. Huh? I'll show you the way to the down below, you maniac. God, they've even got old people in their team. What the hell? They've even employed the elderly. Ah. Right. Uh, wind burst on you. Mud shower on the grumper. Wind! Mud! Sod you, buddy. Embers on grounding. That's a dumb idea. I have burn immunity! Thunderstrike! That's a better idea, but still! It's not brilliant for you! Inductor! Oh, we both have Inductor! Okay, that's, that's actually better to be fair. Alright, grounding is no longer immune, that is fine. Willpower drain for you. And electric storm for the pair of you! Have fun with that! The Grumper's probably going to be the one that's going to survive, so uh, yeah. Lose all of your lovely stamina. The Mastion is dead. Nice. His Inductor does activate. That's annoying. Thunder Strike again on Red Rookie, who is going to die. That's not great. But are you going to survive the overexhaustion? You might do, actually. Red Rookie's dead. That's fine. How much damage do you take? All of it. Yeah, all the damage you're taking. Victory for grounding. You must be that Congress thug we were warned about. Run! Warn the general! Congress forces are coming! Indeed. Run! Flee, worms! Flee! Flee from me! Alright, moving onwards. Oh, more Temtem battles. Yep, slowly walk over to me, why not? Oh, look, Satoshi, a young tamer. What's your name, my dear? Uh, sorry, but I'm in a hurry. Hurry? Why hurry? It's not like those Temtem are going away. 
You're right, Seiko. Iwaba is always so pre pleasantly calm and quiet. See that flying castle over there? Flying castle? No, where? Thing over there, you mean? Oh, what a wonderful imagination you have. No, that's a cloud, my dear. I'm pretty sure it's a flying Belsoto fortress called Talobos, which is unmooring and getting ready to depart as we speak. Sorry, my ears are not as good as they used to be. Can you repeat that? I said that flying castle over there is... Never mind, bye. Oh, I know. Why don't we have a friendly Temtem battle, eh, to celebrate this lovely chat we're having? Oh, great idea, my dear. Yes, let's. Somehow I knew it. Ah, being stalled by the elderly! No! The hell is that? I know what the co the coish is. What the hell's that thing, though? It's a ragnet. Alright, then. I don't know what you are. I'm going to punch you. Because you're a coish, and I know you. Water cannon on snarf. That's not good. Much out on this ragnet. All right, it's weak to it's weak to that. Perfect jet. Okay, interesting play. All right, electrical storm for the pair of them. I'll uh, probably kill the koish. So I'm gonna go for the I'm gonna go for that thing. Punch. Okay, it's gone. Don't know what that thing is. You seem to use like a fighting move. That's about it. Oh god, damn it. No, snarf. Damn it! Grounding! Murder it! Murder the coish now! Murder it! Oh wow, it actually lived. Okay, it didn't it didn't get that wow, okay. Interesting. It's no longer immune. Terry's gonna come in. I only have Terry left again! Terry's gonna have to finish this. And you shall with fierce claw. Hit no, don't do it on Terry. Good. Alright. I don't mind that. I don't mind that. You've Damage yourself through overexertion. Here's a fist claw for you. Have fun. Nice. Nice victory. Terry's up level 61. Good to see. This is a younger woman's game. I don't have the reflexes I used to. What do you say, dear? For oh, sakes. I'm away, old people. Ugh, all right. I think I need a smoke bomb out of here. Luckily, I do have quite a few smoke bombs. So I can get right back here. And heal my team! Heal my team! That's what I can do. Alright. Uh, so what's the best place to go here? I mean, I'll tell you what, I could go down. Let's do this quickly before I forget. Okay, we can't go that way. How the hell do we get there then? How do we get to there? We need to go down somehow, so we need to go this way, and then down, and then here! Aha! Silicon Shard! And Average Crystal! Well, it's stuff, I guess, isn't it? It's stuff. Then we just climb back up here. Lovely! Um, alright. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna get back to where the old people are, because I'm gonna do that off-screen. It's gonna take a while. But I'm going to go for a break here, folks. But in the next episode, let's play Tem Tem. Going to the Belsoto Flying Fortress. It's right in our grasp, and we're not letting them get away. I'll see you then.